want to show you a very unique item that's an absolute must have for any boat or fishing kit. Hopefully you never have to use them, but they will come in very, very handy if you do. These are a pair of double leverage side cutters. Now you're probably thinking, why do I need double leverage side cutters? Why do I need side cutters at all? It's not for cutting wire, it's not for cutting mono, it's for cutting hooks. Now, in the unfortunate event that you get a hook stuck in your hand, foot, wherever it may be, these could come in very, very handy. With the design of them, what it makes it makes it easier for you to do is to cut the hook without having to lean your body weight into getting through that gauge of hook, whatever it may be. Why is that important? Generally, when you get a hook stuck in you, the fish is still attached. You've got a fish thrashing around on one end. The last thing you need is the person trying to cut the hook, not having the strength with slippery, cold hands to try and get through that hook. And that's where the pliers come into their own. They have a clip on the side, undo that, releasing the pliers. My poor trusty spooling towel here has had a bit of, got a bit of mischief. Hook stuck in there. We're gonna use a snapper hook because it's something that we may have already witnessed before or something quite common for our area. Hooks in. In order to cut it, if I was to try and cut that as close to the skin as I can, so that if we have to push it through, Again, we're not, we don't have to pass through the whole hook, which is more pain. From, from here, if these weren't double leverage pliers, I would need to use two hands, lean my body weight into it, bearing in mind the fish may still be attached to either this hook or the second hook in the rig. So that's still kicking around on the deck of the boat or the bank, already putting more pressure on an already painful situation. So I want to cut as close to the skin as I can get. Double leverage pliers means I can do this with one hand. That took no effort at all on my behalf. Now that is a thicker gauge snapper hook, something any snapper fisherman would use. That's how easy it was to cut it. There was no struggle. There was no leaning on the hook for extra leverage for me to actually cut the, the back of the hook off. From there, cutting close to the skin means I can easily turn the hook out and now you're hook free. So remember, double leverage pliers. I want you to grab yourself a pair, put it in your fishing kit. Now not just have them in the kit, I want you to grab a standard set of side cutters. They could be any brand, anything, and I want you to try and cut a snapper hook. Then I want you to use your double leverage pliers and try and cut the exact same hook so that you're prepared and are comfortable and confident having to cut the back of a hook off whenever you need it. Like I said, hopefully you don't need to, but chances are you'll come a time when you need to use them. You need to understand how easy it is to get that hook out stress-free for the other person.